ladder friction. When we place a ladder on the ground and incline to a wall, forces are exerted on each end of the ladder. The top end of the ladder exerts a force on the wall and thus a reaction Rw is exerted on the ladder. Also, at the bottom end, the ladder exerts a force on the ground and thus the ground exerts a reaction Rf on the ladder. Here, when the upper end tends to slide down, the force of friction will be acting vertically upwards and the lower end tends to move away from the wall and therefore the force of friction will be acting towards the wall. For equilibrium of the ladder, the algebraic sum of horizontal forces and algebraic sum of vertical forces will be equal to zero and the total moment about any point must also be zero. Therefore, for limiting equilibrium, we can write sigma fh is equal to zero. That is mu f into rf minus rw is equal to zero. Mark it as equation number one. Now the next condition is sigma fv equal to zero. That is mu w rw plus rf minus w equal to zero. Mark it as second equation. Also sigma m is equal to zero. Now taking moment about the lower end b, we can write w into bc cos theta minus mu w rw into ob minus rw into oa equal to zero. That is w into L by 2 cos theta minus mu w r w into L cos theta minus r w into L sin theta equal to 0. This will be the third equation. Using all three equations, we can find limiting inclination of the ladder with the wall and floor.